The multi-part star question type is when students provide a response and a justification for that response. So it ends up being two questions like you see here. This is an eighth grade science star uh, test question example. So the information is over here to the left, including the stimulus. And over here to the right, you see part A and part B. It's both labeled as question seven, but there are two parts to this question. You can't mimic this exactly in Google Forms, but you can get close to it by coming over here and clicking add question. And I can go ahead and type my information for the question here. I can add a stimulus of some sort if I would like. For example, I could add an image like I'm gonna do here so you can see that modeled. And then I can add on the text as well, I can go ahead and say part A, so it looks similar to the actual star test question, and I can say which student is correct. And then in my answer options, I can say student one, I can say student two, I can say neither student, or I can even say both students. And then I can set the correct answer right here. And I can change the point value and mark done. I can also add this as a required question so students can't skip it. Then I'm going to add a second question. So this is a little bit different. You have to stack the questions. And I can start this one by saying part B. And then I would say using the same question above which evidence supports the answer to part A? And then I come down here to my options and I'm not going to type out evidence, but this would be like evidence explanation one, evidence explanation two, evidence explanation three, and so on. And then I would go in again to my answer key, select which evidence is correct, set my point value, mark done and again set that as required so that students can't skip it when you look back at the preview this is how it will show up so you would see part a here and part b here but you would add that component of using the same question above so they know that these two questions are tied together so it doesn't look exactly the same but it does get you the same uh, material there so students will be answering a part a and a part b modeling a, a multi-part question.